Hi friends. This week we are working with closed reading passages. As we already know that when we're working with closed reading passages, we use two skills, our genre and our thinking jobs. If we have our text in front of us, we also want to always remember to annotate and jot the main idea of the lesson learned for the text. Let's look at the passage for today. It's titled, Get Some Rest. Take a look at this passage to see if you can identify the genre of the passage. Now that you have taken a look at the passage, you can, uh, you can determine the genre is nonfiction and the thinking job is AOT teach. First read. Now it's time for you to read. Read the passage on your own. Use your thinking job as you are reading Think about what the author is teaching you and the author's opinion of the text. Pause the video so you have more time to read the passage. Second read. Now I'm going to read. Make sure you have read the passage on your own. If you need more time, go back and pause the video to continue reading. As I read the passage, you are to follow along with me. Get some rest. What do we all spend one third of our lives doing? Sleeping. Getting enough sleep is one of the basic building blocks to good health. Getting both the quantity and quality of sleep you need will benefit both your mental and physical well-being. Healthy people make the, cho the good choice to get enough sleep every night. Sleep provides their bodies with a variety of positive effects. A physical perk of getting enough sleep is the boost it gives your body's defense against illness. It protects your heart by reducing your risk of high blood pressure and heart attack. A rested body is also able to more easily maintain proper blood sugar levels. Sleep can even help you manage your weight. It helps you control your appetite. People who get the right amount of sleep throughout their lives tend to live longer. Do you remember ever waking up and feeling sluggish or fatigued? Chances are <clears throat> you didn't get enough sleep. School age children need 10 to 11 hours of sleep every night. TV, video games, computers, family events, and homework can all contribute to you not getting your sleep. It is the healthiest to go to sleep at the same time every night and then get up at the same time every morning. Doing this will make you more alert and able to pay attention. When you are focused and rested, you are better and able to solve problems. You remember important information. In other words, you can think more creatively. When you are asleep, your body looks as if it is not doing anything. However, your brain is very active. It is helping you remember everything you learned during the day. Another mental perk to getting 
enough rest is how it makes you feel. Think about how you feel just after you wake up from a nap. Usually, you feel happy and optimistic. You have the energy to face whatever is coming next. When you are deprived of sleep, you can become frustrated and depressed. Easy tasks become complicated and hard to finish. It is important to recognize when you feel this way. One solution to feeling cranky is to get some rest. Being healthy means being safe. Have you ever been so tired that you have trouble just keeping your head up? That is not a good time to ride your bike or be in charge of watching a younger brother or sister. Getting the right amount of sleep daily increases your alertness. This, in turn, makes you more aware of your surroundings. It helps you avoid injuries and accidents. It, helps, it also helps you have good judgment about what is right and what is wrong. This ability reduces your chance of making a dangerous mistake. Sleep is an essential part of a healthy lifestyle. Getting a good night's sleep will do wonders for your body and your mind. A famous American named Benjamin Franklin once said, early to bed, early to rise, makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. Now we have read the passages twice, it is time to jot and answer your comprehension questions. Jot the main idea of the text, pause the video and write down the main idea of the text and then type it into the comments. Comprehension questions. Answer the questions in the comments. Why is getting enough sleep a building block for good health? What are some physical benefits of sleep? Why is sleep a good choice for your mental well-being? Remember to answer your questions in complete sentences. Thank you.